Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in again today. And if you are new to my channel, welcome to you guys too. So today it is that time again where I'm gonna be doing my Birchbox unboxing. So if you wanna know what I got in my August 2018 Birchbox, then stay tuned. This is this month's birch box. It is in collaboration with Etsy. Hope you can see that there. I quite like Etsy, so I was quite happy to see that they were in collaboration with them this month. I'm not massive on the box design this month. However, I did see a sneaky peek preview of the box or boxes on Facebook uh, near the end of July and as far as I'm aware, there were loads of different designs and they had literally just sent you one by random, I think. And this is the one that I got. If you got something different, let me know in the comment section down below what box you got. So because they're in collaboration with Etsy this month, normally when they're in collaboration with somebody, they will give you a voucher. So this one is Live a Beautiful Life with Etsy. So this is actually the voucher. So you get 15% off the Etsy shops that created our August birch boxes. See the selected designers at etsy.me forward slash birch box and use birch box all in capital letters at checkout to get your 15% off. So that's actually quite good. That's one that I might use myself, to be honest with you, because like I said, I do like Etsy, so yay. Right, so I've just opened the little pamphlet that gives you all of the details about the products that's in your box. And yes, I was right. Uh, those are all the different designs of boxes that they have been sending out this month. And to be honest with you, I think I've got the worst one. <laughs> Mine is so plain and so simple. Like, there's some beautiful ones. Like, look at this one here at the top. This, like, starry night one. How gorgeous is that? I hope you can see that all right. But that is just gorgeous. And then you've got some really nice floral ones. Yeah, some of these are just absolutely stunning. And... Mine is the plainest one of the lot. Just my luck, that is. <laughs> anyway, like I said, this is a pamphlet. This has got all of the details about all of the products that I've got in my box. Yeah, as always, I will read this as I am pulling out the products. Okay, so the first thing I am pulling out is another Rituals product. So well, I've had Rituals products in a birch box or even two birch boxes in the past so far this year. And this is Rituals, the Ritual of Happy Buddha. Smile and the world smiles back. Happy foaming shower gel, sweet orange and cedar wood. This is the product here. So yeah, a bit of a boring product, but I guess it is an essential that everybody does need. Like I said, I'm not a massive fan on foaming shower gels. I would prefer just a normal shower gel, you know, one that doesn't foam or soap. But I have already put one of these types of things into the giveaway for this year, so I'm not entirely sure whether I would put this one in there. And to be honest, I quite like the sound of the scent, so I might give it a go myself and see how I get on. So in the blurb here, it says about this Rituals Happy Buddha Foaming Shower Gel. Showers can be just as relaxing as a soak in the tub. You just need the right products. I don't agree. This luxurious shower gel is infused with sweet orange and cedar to rejuvenate your skin and brighten your mind. Transforming into a thick lathering foam on contact with water, it provides a skin softening clean with hydration that lasts. And it's got a yellow dot, which means that it has a four plus star review on the birchbox.co.uk shop. So obviously people really, really like this product. The RRP price for this is 8.50 for a full size. And obviously this is just a sample size, 
but it is a 50 ml sample size so it's actually quite good um, and more of like a travel size rather than a sample size. So next product that I've pulled out is a number four high performance hair care Jeu de Ottoman Sugar Texturizing Spray. That's it there. So a couple of birch boxes ago, I did get a number four blowout spray, which I used and I did really, really like. I'm excited actually to give that a go. I do like good hair products, especially for me because I've got really thin hair. So I need all the tech. <laughs> I need all the texture and the oomph I can get from products. So in the blurb, it says about this number four sugar spray, combining the beachy waves of a salt spray with the nourishment of a mask. This spritz is a hair care hero. Sugar cane and flexible styling aids leave your strands soft, shiny, and with texture aplenty. Lightly spray it onto damp or dry hair, then leave to air dry or blow dry with a diffuser to amp up those waves. Basically, it's saying it does exactly the same job as a sea salt spray does, but you don't get that dry out that the sea salt spray gives you. This actually nourishes your hair at the same time as giving it that texture, which is fantastic. So the RRP price for this is £20 for a full size. By the looks of it, a full size is 145 mil, so that's quite a lot of product for your dollar. Um, and obviously, yeah, this is just a sample size, not a travel size, because this is like 30 mil, so a bit smaller than a travel size. The next product that I've pulled out is something that is completely new to me. I have never heard of anything like this before. If you have, drop me a comment in the box below and let me know what the hell this stuff is like to wear. This is a Clique Cosmetics Melting Lip Powder in the colour Blushing Peach. And that's it there. I hope you can see it. See if I can just like move it around for you a bit, but it's so weird, it literally is a powder. How strange. In the blurb about this Klee Cosmetics melting lip powder, it says, a truly innovative product, this magic formula transforms, <laughs> transforms from pigmented powder to long wearing tint on application. Using the applicator, blend it directly onto your lips as you would a lip gloss and watch as it meshes with your skin for a smudge proof matte pop of colour. Bonus is that it works on cheeks too. Right, it's a little bit sceptical about this bad boy. Uh, looks like it'll be really drying on the lips and I have trouble anyway with dry cracked lips and I can't wear anything that dries my lips out any more than they already are so i'm not even sure if i'm going to be giving that a go but the rrp price for this is 15 pounds doesn't say how big the actual product is but this size is net weight 0.03 ounces so not a lot <laughs> but i suppose that's okay just as a sample size isn't it so yeah and now we're getting on to the full size products in this month's box. So I did see again with the sneak peek preview on Facebook that there were going to be two full size products in this month's box. One of which we were able to choose. You couldn't choose the actual product, but you could choose what color you wanted on the product. And then the other one is just been a surprise. So I'll start off with the one that we were able to choose. This is Dirty Little Secret Eyeshadow Crayon. And I don't know what color mine is in because I just asked them to surprise me. So let's open it up and have a look. Oh, it actually says on here that it's the color gold plated. So I think that's the darker one of the two. Ooh, that's nice. That's a really nice color. Let's give it a swatch. Oh, so creamy that is, that is really nice and creamy. But yeah, hopefully you can see that there. 
Really nice colour that is. Right up my street that is. So, in the blurb about this dirty little secret eyeshadow crayon in gold plated, it says, who said that perfectly applied eyeshadow requires an arsenal of tools? Not us. With this creamy crayon, your fingertips will do the job just fine. Scribble it directly onto your eyelids and blend in for an effortless eye look. It works as a base for powder eyeshadows, a standalone wash of colour or a radiant highlighter. I was thinking you might be able to use this as a highlighter because it has got that sort of like highlightery sort of sheen to it when it hits the light. I kind of hope it's showing up though. I don't know if it is. But yeah, I can definitely see that really really nice i am looking forward to giving this a try with um yeah a whole makeup look so the rrp price for this is 10 pounds 50 quite expensive for an eyeshadow but it does obviously look like you get a lot of product in there obviously like i said this is a full size and yeah i'm happy about that one that's really really good and so the last product that I'm pulling out is, of course, the second full size item that we received. So this is a Dr. Botanicals Pomegranate Superfood Regenerating Sleeping Mask. Ooh, that sounds good. But that's it there. I'm loving the packaging. The packaging is so nice. The colour, this pinky colour is really nice and I just love the simplicity of it. Okay, so I've just been reading the back of this just quickly and it says that it's vegan friendly, nice, cruelty free, which we always like, and 98% natural, which is just brilliant because you don't want any chemicals or crap on your face, do you? And it says that you use it two to three times per week Apply a thin layer onto clean, dry skin in the evening and allow the mask to sink into the skin and leave overnight. You cleanse as normal the following morning. And that is it. It's as simple as that. The blurb about this Dr. Botanicals Pomegranate Superfood Regenerating Sleeping Mask <gasps> What a mouthful says We love it when a product does all the hard work for us and even more so if it works overnight definitely. Apply a thin layer of this pomegranate infused treatment onto clean skin before bed and let it absorb while you catch some zeds. The antioxidants we will rejuvenate tired skin so you'll wake to a glow, hydrated complexion. Yeah. So it says that this is a full size. It's like only 30 mil though. So that's really, really small for a full size product. The RRP price for this as well is £14.90. I'm not sure I'd pay £14.90 for that without trying it first because it's a small amount of product for a reasonable chunk of money. So I'm kind of hoping that you won't have to use a lot of that. However, I'm not going to be using this. I am going to be very kind to you guys this month and I'm going to be putting this full size product into the giveaway at the end of the year. That's it then guys, that was everything that I received in my August 2018 Birch Box. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a huge thumbs up. Also, if you don't get Birch Box yet and you really, really want to give them a try, here is my friends and family referral code just down here somewhere. Use that code to get yourself £5 off on your first box. Thanks again for tuning in. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you haven't done already. It would mean the world to me and I will see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.